Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Visio. In this module, I want to show you how you can link Excel data into a flowchart. So I'm going to create a basic flowchart, picking this option, and I'm going to pick the blank option, and then create. So I've got a blank screen, and then what I'm going to do is go to the data tab and use this quick import tool to bring Excel data into this flowchart. Before I do that, there's the data in Excel that I'm going to bring through. I've got it open, so it's just six tasks that's going to come through into Visio. So the first thing you need to do is click on Quick Import and then browse, either browse for or select, so you can select it if you've already used it for the file that you want to link to and then click Done. And then Visio should identify the data and start importing that and then click on done again. And then the data sits down here in your shape data window. Now, what you have to do is basically select the start shape and then drag the first task onto the screen. And it will be whichever shape you've selected over here. So you don't need to drag that across. Now you'll notice on the shape you've got some data graphics information and that's what is sitting over here. As part of, that part of that import process, this appeared. And I'm going to tick process name, so I'll get the process name going on there. Now if I go back to the Home tab and select the Connector tool so it's on, when I click on the next one and bring in the next linked bit of information, that's already sitting there and then I'll bring the next one develop product so these are all just going to be straightforward processes nothing too technical and then sell product like that and then I'm going to bring an end to the actual whole project and then take that off so you've got the data graphics there this is the link symbol so I want to edit this data graphic I want to take the process name from it so I'm just going to select everything just to make sure I've got everything selected and then this is the one that's selected at the moment but I'm going to edit that data graphic and these are the three things that are displayed so process name is okay I want that but I don't want the label on it so what I'm going to do is edit that item and label position Let's get rid of that so we select not shown. And also I want the label, not the label, the name to sit inside the actual box. So middle, center, OK. OK to that. And then the names go in there. So if you want to, you can change the label color. I'll make that one, click on it first, make that one white. Same with this. Just make, make them white so they stand out. You don't have to do this, but it just stands out a little bit better. Now, the whole point of linking data is that this data is in Excel, and if this data changes, you want this, this flowchart to pick it up. So at the moment, it says £50,000 there for budget. So what I'm going to do is go into Excel and change that figure and then get it to update so you can see it in this diagram. So if I go into Excel... And then open that file, it's called linked Excel link, this one. There's that 50,000. So if I change that to 1,000, it's um, automatically saving. If I go back to Visio, hasn't updated, not yet. But on the data tab, if I click on refresh all, it should refresh that. And then that, that figure will change. And there you go. It's now changed. And this is now updated again. So that's just a very quick video of how you can bring Excel data into a Visio flowchart in this example and link it and have it updated. You can also do that with the timeline and other diagrams as well, such as a Gantt chart or an organizational chart. But this is a very quick one, a bit of Excel data into a flowchart. So hopefully that was of use for you. Thank you for your time and I'll see you on the next one.